Roman ports were always designed depended on the shape of the coastline and its natural features. In sheltered inlets, engineers often built two curved breakwaters, converging toward each other to narrow the entrance and protect ships from the waves. In larger inlets, two separate breakwaters could leave a central gap, creating two entrances instead of one. The same principles applied to ports built on headlands, where engineers sometimes chose straight breakwaters instead of curved ones. In large bays, a single long breakwater could close off the most sheltered side, forming a protected harbour. When the coastline offered no natural protection, they built both a breakwater and a counter-breakwater, a classic Roman solution against rough seas. Ports located at river mouths required particularly inventive and specialised engineering solutions. But technical challenges were not the only factor to consider. The need to ensure excellent land connections between the port, the city and its hinterland could also play a decisive role in the choice of location and overall design of a port.